Hello everyone, this is Nick Nevin, the Witch of Sea Club, and today I'm going to do a reading, a crystal ball reading, and a tarot card reading on the missing child. Her name is Summer Wells. She comes from Rogersville, Tennessee. And um, let me just light my sage. I'm going to uh, smoke my cards and the crystal ball before I do the reading. So she went missing on June 15th. It's been all over the internet. I don't watch the news. I try not to watch the news, but I do watch YouTube and you will get news all over the internet. So most people have probably heard of this case especially if you clicked onto this video. Let's get started here. Just shuffle the deck. So her full name is Summer Moon Utah Wells. This little girl is five years old. She lives in Rogersville, Tennessee. Hawkins County, Tennessee, and she went missing on June 15th, 2021. Spirit, please tell me what happened to Summer Wells. What happened to this little baby girl? What happened to Summer Wells? Sorry for my squeaky chair. Who's involved? Lovers. Lovers upside came out upside down. Who's involved? What happened to her? I'm going to pull out five. Uh, the six of swords. Let me just see if I can get the camera closer. That it falling. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna pull out four cards and then do three. Let's move it to the side. Okay, Spirit, please let me know what happened to Summer Wells. What happened to her? Where is she? Can you tell me about the circumstances with Summer Wells? going missing. Okay, two came out, so we're going with five. So I'm going to pull three cards out underneath each. So we got the four of swords. We have six of swords, three of pentacles, four of swords, and judgment reversed. I don't always read reverse, but I feel like it today, so. Tell me about this lover's card reverse. What do the lover's cards mean? Again, I apologize for the squeaky chair. What does the reverse lover's card mean? Please clarify, spirit. Nine of swords. Spirit. Please tell me, what does the reverse lover's cards mean in regards to Summer Wells, the missing child from Tennessee? Two cards. And I'll read after I pull all the cards. Okay, what does the Six of Swords mean? Spirit, please relate to me what it means. I got two cards that were jumping. 
does this Six of Swords mean? Um, okay, what does the Three of Pentacles mean, Spirit? Please let me know what the Three of Pentacles mean in regards to Summer Wells. Can you give me more clarity on what does the Three of Pentacles mean? Three of Pentacles mean in relation to Summer Wells. What does, let's make a little room here. What does the Four of Swords mean? Four of Swords in regards to Summer Wells, what does the Four of Swords mean? And the disappearance of Summer Wells five years old from Tennessee. Hmm. Okay. Oops, this card wanted to come out. Okay, childhood. Childhood. Anything else? I just feel like one more card wants to come out. I don't know why. Wands. Okay, great. Thank you, Spirit. So, let's begin here. Move these to the side. And go one little pile at a time. One, two, three, four. I thought I said I was going to do five. Oh, well. It is what it is. Whatever came out, came out. I might have put two together but it's meant to be that way. Okay, so we have the lovers in reverse. So there's been some kind of plan and agreement, some coming together, two people coming together, and it's not for good. It's not for good because we have the nine of swords next to the nine of wands and then the six of pentacles. So. Some people came together, they're in cahoots, they came together with a plan, and the plan did not work out for them. It's making them worried, distressed, there's fear here, um, there's defensiveness. Now, the, the agreement, the, the partnership, somehow has something to do with money. Not sure what that is yet. I'm not getting anything definite. Okay, then we have the Six of Swords moving away from troubled waters. So people wanted to get out of their situation. They wanted to move away. They wanted a better life. And then what happened? I don't know what order these really came in. Uh, it doesn't matter. Seven of Cups. So they wanted to get away from something. They wanted to move away. This person is very confused. Very confused. Um, very self-involved. Confused. Extremely self-involved. But th this is also telling me about the situation that she's she's been moved away probably towards water. There's a lot of confusion around this case. Um, a lot of things being held in, information being held, kept away from anyone, but we will find out. We will find out. The hermit is here shedding light on the situation. So what has been kept down, held down, the confusion that everybody has around this case around this disappearance. She just left, she disappeared. This wall of confusion um, could be someone held captive. We are going to find out the information. Why um, it could be abduction, captive, you know, being captive, held captive, confusion, a lot of nonsense going on on the internet about her, but they're trying to get away with something, trying, um, they may have originally had a plan, 
this cahoots, this plan, may have been regarding money and a better future. The next card we had was the Three of Pentacles. Here again, we have a plan, devising a plan. Three people coming together, devising some kind of plan. What is this plan? Let's get some clarity. King of Cups, the Father. I know he's a Scorpio. Scorpio card, the Father, making plans. Three other people. Um, Justice is not being served right now. Information coming out soon regarding the father. Now this is strange because when I, uh, I read on this quite a few times for myself, a lot came out about the mother, but today it's bringing me information about the father. Justice not being served. News about justice not being served. I feel that the plan um, could have been his worry that if what was really found out about Summer, that he wouldn't, he wouldn't get a fair trial. Something would not go right for him. The information would not be fair or just to him or his family. And so perhaps he had to devise some plan. Now, I hate when I sort of go off in this direction because I'm bringing some logic into it. I don't want to do that. I don't want to bring my own personal bias or logic into this so let me just let me clear my own energy <laughs> let me clear my own energy uh the next card we have here is four of swords i'm just burning some sage I'm going to, to put this around myself clear my own energy of my bias I want to be totally psychic with this. No biases. Okay. Because I'm already getting bias here. When I see this, uh, this, you know, the tarot goes easy on this card, but I always see this as someone has died, wounded in battle. Um, there is a person laying on top of a sarcophagy. Is that how you pronounce it? Okay. Judgment. Judgment is reversed, so instead of things coming out, hmm, they're digging in deeper. So regarding, I feel, you know, now I'm feeling hmm, death around this situation, fortunately. A lot of things juggling information, the happiness card, the sun, sun has gone out of this situation. This situation, the light has gone out from the child. They're still looking, they're still searching. Um, but also the people, whoever has taken her, whatever they have done with her, I feel it's towards um, the east, towards the coast, they've taken her. Okay. I could go on about this. I could pull more cards, but I'm on 13 minutes. So I'm gonna just get started with the crystal ball because I want I want real psychic impressions because sometimes the cards can be a little misleading. Hopefully I can move the camera up with the, sorry about the jumpy camera. Um, let's see, I need to get the light behind it. Now I read through my intuition, I read through my psychic sensing, which I'm very clear audience. Um, the crystal ball is described to see images, and it's not that you're going to get a picture, um, you know, of Auntie M in here. <laughs> You're going to, it's, I get sort of a clouded view and I sense images. Um, what you see may not be what I see. So leave a comment below what you see in the crystal ball. It's always interesting to read about what others are getting from the situation. Okay. 
So again, I ask spirit to please guide me and my words and what I sense and feel in this situation. Sorry, there's an airplane going. I'm waiting for that to go. I'm just gonna, I feel the energy up too from the crystal ball. I hear from spirit and I do the scrying. Mm. Very, oh, I almost feel sick because, yeah, I do feel sick. I'm feeling a headache. I have um, labored breathing, labored breathing. I feel tightness in my chest, almost as if I've been struck in the chest. Also feeling my lungs. It's hard to breathe. This is very dark, very dark. I'm feeling lunacy, like really disturbed people. A lot of intoxication, drunkenness, nefarious plans. Drug dealers, drug deals going on, nefarious plans. Who are these drug dealers? What are these people? Mm, I'm, I'm, ugh. Three really seedy men. I don't know if one of them's a father, I don't think so, but I have three I'm not getting a good vibe from the father. I'm getting a headache from him as if I've been struck in the head. I'm not saying, I'm feeling that's her, but I'm not saying that she was struck in the head by the father. I'm saying something in this situation, she was struck in the head, um, feeling the lungs, actually a stabbing towards my heart. Not an actual knife though, like a stabbing pain, like a punch. Uh, hitting something being hit even a fall was this an accident I'm feeling really um, shady characters around the home men talking about the children eyeing the children not just summer they're eyeing the children there's been talk about abuse, how the children look, how they're being taken care of. They're not being taken care of. Who's watching the girl? There's, that's what I heard, heard. Who's watching the girl? So I am speculating. Is this, um, and this is for entertainment purposes only. These are just my psychic opinions. I feel like a plan. People started talking. People were talking and they were talking about the children. Hmm, they're not being taken care of. Ugh, ugh, these people. Ugh. I feel like the mother, the parents know. They don't know what happened to their daughter. I feel they really don't know what happened to her. But what they know, what they know is the people that have been surrounding their home. Um, the mother, the mother, she is inviting some very strange characters, these kind of lunatic energy. <sighs> lunatic energy, yeah. They're just like really negative vibes from the people there is confusion in their minds as well. There's, a, there's like psychological, psychologically damaged people. Mm -hmm. Psychologically damaged and also drug induced confusion. Um, 
not caring because they're so out of it and they're just doing really wild, horrible things. That house, that home, uh, there's a lot of violence in that home. I feel a lot of violent energy. Um, there's a lot of physical abuse. There's a lot of abuse, mental abuse, you know, telling, everybody telling each other negative things. You're stupid. I'm hearing you're stupid. You're good for nothing. Um, I could take you, you know, I brought you into this world. I could take you out. That kind of energy coming from the father and from the mother, um, volatile. I'm also getting from the mother a psychological um, damaged past that she just, you know, she uses substances to not think about her past and she does when she starts getting drunk and smoking weed she starts neglecting the children i'm not saying they don't love their children but they are not uh airplanes today um they're not doing well in that home those children are not doing well i get a sick feeling from that home uh, from the people that come into that home, those the surrounding people that come in that are invited in, uh, especially the mother invites these horrible characters in. What did they do? Spirit, tell me who did this? What did they do? There's t a lot of talk. And even the father has talked with these men in this way, almost like they could get money off of the kids. It's disgusting. Somehow get money off of the, using the kids somehow in some scheme. But he forgets about this. He has no recollection. He's out of his mind drunk, I'm seeing that. The mother too completely out of their minds and these other people come in and they see how they're not watching. Oof, a plan was made, a plan was made. I'm getting around the time of March, a plan was made and they've been going there and hanging out since March. Watching, watching how everybody works, the, the routine. They know all the ins and outs. Now, I always, I thought, you know, my bias is how could there be an abduction? How could there be an abduction? Uh, because they have a lot of dogs on the property. Um, sorry, I had to get a drink for a moment. Um, drinking my coffee, not a drink drink. <laughs> uh, but I felt like I needed to pull a card. Knight of Wands, somebody came in quickly. Yeah, yeah, why an abduction? Because the dogs, the dogs would bark. If the dogs don't know you, they're going to bark. Someone came in very quickly and this, look, there's a lot of orange, you know, the red truck. I'm seeing summer at the window. Mm. The bully. The bully. The bully comes in quickly. There's light. <laughs> the bully comes in quickly here. Ugh. And then there's the sadness. I don't know why I had to take up these cards. Let me just look a little deeper. Um, I think what the parents know, what the father knows, and what the mother knows is the people they invited into their home, they were not good, and now they're feeling guilty for that. They know who the bullies are. They might even have a sense of who took them. They came in quickly. 
I also just wanted to let me put these cards back. I wonder if the church gives me the creeps. The church, whole church thing. Knight of Pentacles. What about the church in this situation? Nine of Pentacles. Magician. Okay, yeah. I'm feeling that there's someone also in the church, so I don't know if one of these characters went to their church um, or has, has some kind of uh, good standing in the church. Someone with money. Someone was also looking at them from the church, saying those children aren't being cared for and having bad thoughts about doing something with the children. There's a lot of weirdness with that church. I don't know why I get this very bad energy about the church, about the higher ups, the people with money, the authority people in that church. And they're looking at that family as well. So there's predators around. Lots of predators around. There's church members that are predators. Drop the card. King of Pentacles. There's someone with a lot of money looking at them. That could also be devising a plan. How to get those children coming at them. Here comes the man with the club. Gonna lay down the law. Gonna lay down the law of God. A lot of conflict. Discussions, conflict. Um, maybe even threatening the parents. This worry card is there. Again, making plans. The three of wands, making plans. What are these people in the church doing? Money. Oh, we have a nice family that we could almost sell, sell these children to. There's some weird shit going on down there. It sounds really far-fetched, but I mean, the energy around this is so bizarre. So bizarre. Hmm. Was it a full moon there that time? I'm getting images of the moon. taken somewhere and this place okay this is the way I see it one guy came up and I don't know I'm not getting if it's the the drug people hanging out in the house or if it's the church people but somebody comes by that knows the family I see him coming up the hill halfway and waving he sees someone either playing outside and then going inside. He's been watching. The dog's on, on alert because he's down the hill. He's parked the car down the hill. Nobody's aware. He waits. He's, he finally sees Summer in the window. I see her waving. She's waving. She knows him. I think he picked up one of her puppies. I think there's puppies there. He picked up one of her puppies, brought it down the hill, and he's waving to her come, and motioning to her, come here. Happy, your puppy came down the hill, come get your puppy. And she knows this man, so she's not afraid to go down the hill to go get the puppy because she knows this guy. Either he's been in the home or she's, he's been in the church. Serious shit, man. The Knight of Swords. He's young. The guy that comes to the house is young. It was a struggle to get her. Hmm, she's a little fighter. The burden, the Nine of Wands, the burden. It was a struggle getting her. Ugh. Doing something bad. The Justice Court reversed. So this young guy came. He was sent by someone else though. This was, I don't think this was just his doing. He was sent. 
I believe it was to get Summer, but it could have also been the other younger brother as well. Get one of them. Like, we're going to, I feel like they were going to take them out. More than one. Now, where is Summer? Summer, where are you? She's in a sort of valley, a well, no, not a well, it's a slope. Darkness, she's taken out in the dark. I'm seeing her in a truck. I don't believe she's alive when she's in that truck. She, I'm seeing a winding road winding road and a yellow caution sign like the road is very steep and winding so there's a caution to go slow that caution sign on one side of the road it's a steep road so there here's the road and then there's there's a slope and then there's a river so that's how they can identify it there's a river there's a slope a road and then a sort of higher slope going up a mountain or a hill wooded wooded area so she's buried in the mountains it's not near the home though she was taken outside of Hawkins County going towards the coast so she could even be over state lines by now and I I feel bricks being put on her not bricks boulders being put on her boulders even maybe slow cement cinder blocks so i'm seeing a shallow grave i'm seeing dirt going over her then stones then cement blocks then more stones brush all around this this they're building it up like a mound dirt stones bramble but they didn't make a large, it's not deep. It's not deep in the ground. Ugh, I'm getting so sick. I really am getting a headache. <sighs> Poor Summer. Um, I mean, I hope I'm wrong. I really hope I'm wrong when she's alive because the other impression I got was that she was kept alive for a while. I believe they were going to try to sell her, but she was trouble. She was a lot of trouble. Made a lot of noise. I see them smothering her, putting something over her mouth. This is really sick, really, really sick. I'm feeling so sick. I'm feeling like I can't breathe. Again, my lungs, I can't breathe. I have a headache, like I've been hit in the head. They're trying to knock her out. Like they gave her some kind of medicine. It didn't work, so they're like trying to knock her out. Ugh, but she's a biter. She's so small. Oh my God, this, ugh. I'm sorry, I'm getting really sick. I don't think I should go on about what I say. I don't want to go into this energy anymore. Just tell me, spirit, will she be found? Will her remains be found? I hope she's alive and will be found. But if my impressions are right and she's passed on, will she be found? Will they ever find her? going to come out within the month. The FBI knows though, people, don't worry. The FBI, they are on to this. They are on to these groups of people that want to abduct children and sell them or traffic them. And they're on to that whole aspect. They're looking at everyone. So don't, just because we're not hearing information quickly doesn't mean they don't have information. This thing is so convoluted. It, there's so many layers here, so many people. 
had their eye on these children. Not just Summer, they better... Man, so many people were eyeing them for a long time and making really horrible, nefarious plans to take these kids from them, to traffic them, to sell them, or to just abuse them. We're gonna hear a lot in about a month. So August, middle of August, August 15th. Um, I'm also getting the number 27. I don't know if there's a root 27 or 27 days. I don't know, I'm, I saw the number 27. They're not gonna, you know, the search, though, searching for her remains, she's not there. They're gonna have to get these people who made the plans, they're gonna have to get the kidnappers, the abductors, to find out what they did with her body because they'll never find the body. Nobody's going to stumble across this. It's, there's, I don't know what they put on it, but it's covered up. Either animals will get to dig her up. Ugh, I don't even want to talk about it. She won't... I don't know if they'll ever get the remains, but they'll find out. They'll find... Excuse me. They'll find out. I don't know why I'm seeing a month. Something's coming out in a month. 27 days. Oof, God, there is a lot of lunatic energy around this. Lunatic energy really disturb people. That church, I don't like those members. I think they were making plans, and those people that came in the house were making plans. I believe it's a young person. Now, there is a boy, a 15-year-old boy. I don't see it's him. It's, it's not him. And please don't put his name down here. I don't want YouTube to strike this video. So please don't use names. Just use Summer or the parent's name. Um, don't use the name of that child, um, that boy. I don't see it as him. Tell me what you think in the comments below. I'd like to read what you people think about this. Um, if we have the comments on, I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to have to check that. Uh, I'm going to put this on a playlist. The playlist is called, I think it's called Witch Investigator or Psychic Witch Investigator, something like that. But I'll put the playlist in the description box below. You can click onto that. So if you only want to see uh, my reading, my crystal ball readings on missing persons, that is going to be um, what to watch. Uh, I hope I'm wrong, everyone. I just get some really, really horrible, horrible abuse feelings in my body when I do this and headaches and ugh, it's not good. Just um, pray for this little girl that wherever she is, that she is in peace and she has no more suffering. And that will also uplift her energy if she has passed on and is somehow still connected to the earth plane. Allow her to release, so pray for her release, that she goes with the divine. Okay, everyone? Please give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Uh, subscribe. Subscribe to the playlist. And um, I'll talk to you all soon. I wish I had better news here. But I'll talk to you all soon, everyone. Take care. Bye-bye.